Alright, Shalom, all honor and praises be to Yahweh by Shemel of Shai. Double honors unto the apostles of great most honor and Shalom to everyone out there teaching out there in the highways and byways and truth and sincerity, man. I just want to speak on a you know point, man. And then I'm gonna just go into the scriptures. This is um, Revelation chapter eleven and eight, and it says, And the dead bodies shall lie in the street of the great city, and you know, when it says the and dead dead bodies is you know is um speaking about what the the the, um, the, the um, you know the um, twelve tribes of uh, of Israel being in a dead state over there in the land of um, America, man. Because as the scripture says in Proverbs twenty one and sixteen, man, you know um the the the, the man that will will wonder without the way of understanding shall remain in the congregation of the dead. It says, which is spiritually called Sodom and Egypt. You know, and it, it's what is 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 saying according to the scripture that that great city is spiritually called Sodom and Egypt. And if you read in Deuteronomy twenty eight and sixty eight, it speaks about the twelve tribes of Israel will go into slavery in Egypt again. That new Egypt, Egypt, that spiritual Egypt is talking about America. So when it says spiritually Sodom and Egypt, that's talking about also there in America. And it says where also our Lord was crucified, crucified meaning to cross out. And part of that, and the main part of that was to, you know, cross out the, 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 the true image of the Lord. Because us not already know that the, 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 the Lord wasn't crucified over there in America. But when it says crucified, crucified meaning to cross out, and part of that. And the, the main part of that is crossing out the true image of the the the, 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 um, the um, Lord and painting him as a, as a, as a, as a so-called person who is was white, which according to the Bible they are known as Edomites. But the point I want to speak on is is what is spiritually so, man. And in fact. I have a few, 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 few articles here, man. I just want to just speak on a point, man. Because um, this point came into my mind to think on in terms of over there in the States. So it says here, man. It says, this is um, from, so, so this is an actual, actual site, man, that, um, has information on the amount of trans people in America, man. So it says, um, it says, yeah, so it says, yeah. here's how, how many transgender people live in your state. Now, as you can see, that there is a trans person that's clearly a dude but wearing sunglasses or some shit. And it says all genders matter on its top. Now it's like, look, man, the M D M D M D M. Scripture clearly says, male and female created he them and called their name Adam, man. The M D M D M D M Lord, because I think, I think an article came out like last month sometime, that like there's a state over there in the states where you 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 you, you can have like. 40 different kinds of genders, which is just total complete madness. But it says, five years ago, the University of California, Los Angeles Law School, Williams Institute, which conducts research on sexual orientation and gender identity law and public policy, announced that there was approximately 700,000 Americans identifying as transgender. Which that's a large part, man. But if you go down in this article, it says it says, but that estimate may have been too far, been far too small. So there, according to the institute's new survey, there are about 1.4 million transgender people in America. Which is just, which is, look, man, look, not no, I take the truth. Not one transgender person is supposed to be alive, because according to the Bible, that's an abomination. That's that's an abomination. That's just that's just that's just 
wickedness, man. And great consequences are gonna come for America because of those acts. So this is um second people um second Peter two and six and it says and turn the cities of Sodom and Gomorrah into ashes, condemn them with an overflow. Making them an example unto those that after should live ungodly. So, as we know, according to the scriptures, man, Sodom and Gomorrah and the other three cities got turned into ash. In fact, the actual sulfur balls, which are still found in that in in, in those lands, yeah, are ninety-seven percent pure, pure, fresh mini balls of sulfur which is the most potent balls of sulfur balls of sulfur that's been found on the planet you know and it says that that basically that event man you know that 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 righteous act of the lord was an ensample unto those that after should live on live ungodly because what so what kind of thing will um take place then homosexuality lesbianism and and what he you know fucking um it's the reality man you know pedophilia you know just just stuff that's off but that's the thing that's that that's that's the same thing that takes place over in here now. Uh, well, I would say, well, uh, it obviously takes place here, man, in England. But but the whole point as to why I'm doing this video is based 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 on America, and that's the same thing that takes place over there in America, man. Spiritually, spiritually Sodom and and Egypt, man. And it says, so let's go into the word and sample, which um the reason why I'm uh, um going to this word because I was actually you know going through an old video by the apostles man and I just thought hey man this is a, this is a good point to speak on in combination with the, the, the um the, the, the articles I got and it says it's from the Greek word who podagma and it means a sign suggestive of anything delineation of a thing representation figure copy an example for limitation no sorry for imitation or the thing to be or of the thing to be imitated but it says for a warning of a thing to be shunned that's right man so the lord according to Second Peter three and six, he 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 made that place an example, yeah, a, a warning of this is what's gonna happen to you if you do these acts, man. As the scriptures clearly says, man, in Psalms, in, in Psalms thirty six, it says this. It says this in Psalms 36, man. It says, The transgression of the wicked saith within my heart that there is no fear of God before his eyes, man. That's right, man. Because look, man. Sin is the transgression of the law, man. But, 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 but these guys have no fear going against the laws and statutes of the Most High. But that's why the Babylon the Great, which is according to the Bible, is known as America. Is going to be as when Sod, as as when Yahweh overthrew Sodom and Gomorrah, and I'm gonna read it now. This is um, Isaiah chapter 13, and 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 19, and it says, and Babylon, the glory of kingdoms, the beauty of the child these excellently, see, shall be as when Yahweh. Over through Sodom and Gomorrah, it shall never be inhabited, neither shall it be dwelt from generation to generation, neither that shall the Arabian pitch, pitch tent there, 
neither shall the shepherds make their fold there. But wild beast of desert shall lie there, and the house is full of doleful creatures, and owls shall dwell there, and such as, you know, shall shall dance there, and wild beasts of the island shall cry in the desolate houses, and dragons in their places. Her, her, her time is near to come. Her days shall not be prolonged because after the, the, after the land of um, America is destroyed, man, it ain't, it ain't ever gonna just spring back up. You know, these people gonna be there and make America great again. No, that's what scripture says. It shall neither be them root nor branch because yes, there they ain't gonna be any no any more root. There ain't gonna be no trees. It's gonna be just a desert. But it ain't gonna leave them any root, root or branch because they, they ain't gonna spring spring up again into power again or just just you know just somehow rebuild America. That ain't gonna happen. And for um, for um, those who ain't sure who say, ah, uh, but but how do you know? This Babylon here in Isaiah 13 isn't speaking about over there, man, in the rock. But it says what in verse 20 that it shall never be in it in heaven. And upon this day, August 5th, 2016, you, you still have people over there in Iraq. So that's how we know we ain't talking about it. But if you go for the scriptures, you, you know, if the spirit of Yahweh yeah, yeah, shines upon you, you'll get the understanding that that's talking about America. But I'm gonna end with two two points. So 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 this is so so if you cast your mind back to the first article that I read um I saw that I that put that, 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 up on the screen, it said that what one point four million people in America alone are transgender. Now if you single-handedly compare the amount of transgender in America alone to whole populations of certain countries on the planet, you'd find out that there's, there's literally more transgender people in America than there are, are whole populations of people in certain countries. Now this is, as you can see, the, the population of people, the um, population of people in Malta, Brunei, Bahamas, you know, is, is significantly less. Yeah. It's significantly less than the whole than the population of just transgender people in America alone. Uh, and that ain't to include people who, who are bisexual, that ain't people that, that, that ain't gonna include people who, who are gay. I ain't gonna conclude people who are, who are who are into children, who are into pedophilia, who are into to 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 to, to, to um, bestiality. That ain't gonna include people who just like having sex with dead people. That that ain't gonna include all of that, man. You know. But that's why the the Lord made Sodom and Gomorrah an example of unto those who shall shall live on God a warning. You know. Because you ain't gonna take you to the water because it's in the scriptures, you're gonna be ash, man. So that there's over a hundred countries on this list that the actual population of just people, transgenders in America alone outnumbers the whole population of whole countries. Now, I, I, I'm gonna just this last article as well, man. Turns out. I actually brought this information out uh, out um, a good period of time ago. It turns out that bestiality is only illegal in 37 states in America. Bestiality is legal in 13 states in the United States. Amen. But that's why the scripture again says in Hagen Peters, man, that the Lord gave that place as an example, and the same judgment upon them is going to come upon America too. So you know, you know with that I'm gonna say, all praises be to our Bashmal Shai. Don't mind us until the apostles agree. Most on, Shalom.